I'm here to try to uh, express the significance of the past year. I sat in the hot seat a year ago. Actually, it was April 11th. I remember it quite well. We want to guide you softly by saying, I'm here to express the significance of where I stand. Where I stand. I'm here to express the significance of what's coming from where I stand. In other words, can you feel this shifting, shifting, shifting? Not where I was a year ago, not even so much where I am now, but the significance. Of, I'm here to express the enthusiasm I have for what I can feel unfolding. That's the best way of saying it. That certainly is. Yeah. Because a year ago, I sat in this seat and I said I wanted a credit card, debt free, that I can hand to Ron Oyer and say whenever there's something coming up, I'm there. Uh, March 21st, I got a check for $35,000, paid off my credit cards. I now have a, a credit card with zero balance, and I'm paying for the Alaskan cruise and the Canary Island cruise. I remember it so well because you told me to get out, and in my room, there was those money manifestation cards. And I just put one out, and it just said, Tell a better feeling story. And it just keeps getting better and better and better. It really, really does. I just well up inside. The magnificence of this. And what it really also works. That's a really good point of attraction, by the way. Oh. That feeling of trust and worthiness and appreciation is such a good point of attraction. It definitely, definitely. And um, there's a particular movie that started happening just before I got that check. And it's the Thomas Crown Affair. And there's a scene in there where she says, God, I hate being a foregone conclusion. And I love knowing what is happening to me is a foregone conclusion. It is magnificent. I lost this ring and I'm on a tarmac and the plane's just taking off and there it was in the bag that I packed with my goggles and scuba gear. You know, little things like that, I just know there's, you know, I'm valuing the little things more because I have a little bit difficulty with the bigger things. Because when I left here, um... Big things a, wobble a little more than little things, yeah. but when you focus with appreciation on the unwobbling little things, they get bigger and bigger and bigger and bigger and bigger. Until pretty soon, you've got such big things going and there's no wobble at all. And others are looking at you and saying, how is it that you don't wobble over those big things? And you say, because I didn't wobble over the little things. Yes. And I'm learning that significantly because I came here and I had a Hyundai that didn't have power or anything. It didn't even have radio. I had earphones on and I listened to you guys driving to work. And the reason is because I drive a thousand miles a week. And I didn't want a whole lot, but I always... I wanted it to be as uncomfortable as possible. Yeah, then I started looking at the Mercedes-Benz going down the roads, and I says, I can get one of them. And within three weeks, I had one of them. But I didn't value it as much, and I crashed it. I had 90 miles an hour, hit a thing, so, you know, so... But I was smart enough, I was smart enough to get replacement car value insurance, and they gave me a brand new one with more money in a new model year, and... I rode that through a puddle and that one was washed up and then I said, I, I better go back and just book some cruises and just have some more fun. And that's kind of what happened. And, and what made it so much easier to deal with was the checkbook. We like game. his seminar better than ours. Oh. <laughs> that checkbook game that you have, that works great. I got used to writing $35,000, $93,000 deposits stuff like that. So Are you saying that it caused your expectation to shift? Oh, God, yes. It was easy. It was easy. So, you know, when writing out the balances of the, you know, the credit card, it's not a problem because there's more coming. It's here. You know, I'm just trying. It's a foregone conclusion. It certainly is. Thank you very, very much for that. Nothing.